Hi there, this is Tim with a short video and this is what we're going to talk about today is uh, three things. Number one, um, is it easy to uh, do translation work? Simple answer, no. Number two, is it really complicated to actually do the translation technically speaking? And the answer is really simple. And number three, is this a really good idea for me to do? You know what? I, I really hope that you'll give it a whirl. Um, we're really trying to spread the Namaste Yogas around the world, and it just makes so much sense to uh, to use uh, people's native languages. So what I will do is muddle through a translation. Um, what I will share with you is some of the uh, some of those th some of the technical side of things as to what you actually should expect when you're doing it, and uh, hopefully it will just be a really short and easy video that you'll be able to appreciate and understand. And if you have any questions, please don't hesitate. Send me a quick email and uh, we'll get together and I can help you through the uh, the process. Uh, but so basically what you need is a computer um, with a microphone. Uh, this particular one is a headset microphone. I find it works really, really well. Um, if I'm doing professional voiceovers for, for somebody, then I will use um, something like this. Um, this is uh, what they call a Yeti Blue, and uh, it's, a, it's a lovely microphone. Um, you can, uh, if you were, if I was going to be using the Yeti Blue for uh, for translation, then I would actually have a headphone um, plugged into uh, into this as well, and uh, that way I would be able to listen to uh, my voice in one ear, but actually be able to hear the recording in the other. So now that I've shown you the technical side, um, the other side would be the software. What are you going to use for software? And uh, the simple answer there is really what are you comfortable using or what's available to you that's uh, readily available to you. I happen to use Camtasia. I find it uh, it's actually pretty decent. Um, if you're on a Mac, you might use Garage GarageBand. And uh, following that, uh, really, it's not overly complicated. Um, basically, what you're going to be doing is playing the video on this computer screen and uh, listening to it and then perhaps you're going to hit pause on your recorder or sorry press um, play or record on your recorder I guess you'd press and uh, you'll do the translation and hit pause go back to the video and sort of go through it um, sentence by sentence or uh, depending on how uh, talented of a translator I, I suppose it's possible that you could be so gifted as a translator that you could uh, translate the entire thing as you know in real time and that would be awesome too <laughs> um, you know I live with two incredibly intelligent women uh, one of whom is completely bilingual she thinks and uh, reads and uh, does everything in two languages um, and she's only 10 uh, I can only imagine what she'll be like in a few years but uh, Melissa and I are, uh, are are blessed being able to speak one language um, and so please don't laugh at my uh, my my attempt at a German translation in the video example best of luck as I said if you have any questions please don't hesitate let me know get back to me send me an email but uh, hopefully the next step once you've got a microphone like this or a microphone like this you should be off to the races. Have an awesome day. We really look forward to, to hearing your translations of Namaste Yoga episodes. All the best. Cheers. Alrighty, so here we go. And the first bit is you're going to pull a video up that you want to record, obviously. And uh, I'm going to take the example here of episode 101. Uh, you'll notice that every video is has some similarities. Um, in this particular, or in pretty much every video, there's an intro, usually just a few words from Melissa telling you what episode number it is. Then it goes into the commercial, and uh, once the commercial is done, then it goes into the rest. She usually introduces herself, the show, um, thanks sponsors, that kind of thing, moves into the actual working of the actual episode itself, and then at the very end, uh, Namaste is out, and then we run credits. Now, obviously, through the credits and the... Um, and the other part, the uh, the introduction, the musical interlude introduction, if you like, that you just keep recording, but you keep it, uh, you just don't talk. And that, that makes it really easy for me when I take your audio file and then merge it with this video file, because at the end of it all, what you'll end up sending me is a 58-minute audio file, or 58 minutes and 5 seconds will be perfect, and then I just overlay it and just put it in the right spot. But I'll be able to hear that, uh, and uh, in the past it's just worked out really well. So here goes my example of it. Um, what I will be doing here is uh, you'll be able to hear it as well in the background, so I'm going to turn the volume down really low here. But for yourself, when you're doing the recording, if you're doing it, uh, probably do the same thing, um, or even put it through your... Uh, headphones so there's no audio from her talking back so you don't get any kind of weird feedback or any kind of other things um, but for the 
purposes of training, you'll actually be able to hear her talking in the background here, and I will start doing it. I'll do a, a brief recording here in, I'll uh, obviously German here for me, because uh, that's the only thing I learned in die Schule, in the school. And here we go. I record right to the back, click on record, and... As soon as I hit play. Heute Namaste Yoga ist Yoga 101. And remember, even though I'm talking right now, <laughs> you would actually be completely quiet at this point while we go through. Hello and welcome auf Episode 101 von Namaste Yoga. Ich danke Ihnen allen für Ihr Engagement und Feedback. And I think that's probably enough of my horrible German accent. So you get the idea now. What I'm doing is I'm listening to her talk and I'm speaking back in the language and I'm recording just my voice. Um, following that, uh, I would just uh, save the file. It'll be an MP3 file if you don't mind. Email it off to me. And I will then uh, take a listen to the audio quality. Uh, probably the best thing to do at the very beginning is just send me like a quick 30 second version of what you're planning on doing. And I'll just confirm that the audio quality is useful. Um, I can't imagine that it wouldn't be. I mean, I'm sure it would be fine. It's just uh, sometimes people have, uh, you know, weird uh, technical things happening with files. And so would much rather you only spent 30 seconds doing it than spending, you know, an hour doing it and then finding out afterwards that the audio wasn't useful or there's some weird feedback happening. And I can help you troubleshoot that as well. Have an awesome day. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you have any questions, as I said in the beginning, please don't hesitate. Send me an email. I'm only too happy to try and help. And I'm really looking forward to spreading Namaste Yoga around the world in the languages that the viewers will appreciate and understand. Because let's face it, the world isn't all English speaking. There are plenty of other languages out there. I'm especially interested in people doing German, Portuguese, Italian, Swedish, uh, Dutch, for all the Nederlanders out there. Uh, French would be great. Spanish, I think I may have already mentioned that, would be awesome. Uh, other languages, again, just uh, spreading Namaste worldwide is just uh, the whole goal. So thank you very much for watching, and have an awesome day. Cheers.